Oh my, oh God. my gosh. Please be quick. It's like freaking 40 degrees. <laughs> 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 oh my gosh. This and then is, when you're hot and you fumble uh, and you're fumbling because they're just so hot. Ah oh shit, we've got to do up that thing. Hold on. Every second you spend getting ready, I'm just like gonna lose it. A nuclear reactor. <laughs> <laughs> just get, like I'm ready. ready. I'm ready. Okay, okay. Ready for freaking meltdown. I shouldn't complain, it's fantastic. Oh, God. Okay. Jump okay, on, okay. baby. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, my God. Okay, getting on. Ah! Everything's locked up, eh? Yeah. Tank bag and all that. We're good to go. Yep. Vents open. Check. Uh, oh. oh, God. Oh, my gosh, literally. Sweat pouring down my face. The same. And everything else. It's 30 degrees and it's 9.50 now. It's 10 o'clock. Yeah, I've got sweat running down between my boobs. Sweaty into boobies. my pants. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing I've got a bikini on. Yeah, we've got our gear on ready just to throw the bike gear on the ground and jump in the sea. That's Pretty the much. That's the plan today. Yeah, we're ready to hit the beach as soon as we get there, pretty much. Eh? Yeah. Oh, did you get your lava lava out? No, it's in my thingy, but it's easily accessible. Right, good. We ain't got no towels. Oh, oh, oh that's my better. Gosh. Oh, nice and cool. Oh. Oh. Oh, if it's 30 degrees at 10, oh gosh, what's it going to be like it? I don't know, because it gets hottest in New Zealand about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does, yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so early afternoons when everybody gets burned. Yeah, really, really, really hot. If you're having a few drinks in the sun, it is the danger time. So did you have a nice stay? Oh, wow, wasn't it cool? It was cool. We went on an epic walk. We did. We weren't prepared for it, but we had a brilliant time, didn't we? Oh, it was so good. Um, man, did we kill some calories or what on there? Yeah, that was uh, full on all right, yeah. About 10 kilometres. Um, yeah. The first part, a very, very steep hill. Um, well, we were both going to sort of like thinking about turning around but neither of us wanted to give up no eh? we didn't want to we, and we really wanted to find the lake the tarn at the top but then we found out it was about another eight kilometers after where we got to and we were like stuff there yeah i mean you, a hike. if you did a day hike you could do it but well we didn't have a backpack we no, no we had water, nothing yeah no sunblock so i was like oh let's just go up here and uh so me being me, I was just, okay. And we just had a beer to a nice cold beer, and then of course that makes you a bit more thirsty. Yeah. Oh, it was so stupid, we should have just taken a bottle of water. I'm amazed you didn't. You take a bottle of water everywhere you go. Yeah, well, I didn't know I was going to hike up a bloody mountain, did I? Mm, neither did I, to be <laughs> honest. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm glad we did that, and we, we got back and, um, Although it was hot, I jumped straight to the hot pool and it was oh, so nice on the aching muscles. Um, one thing that kind of was a little bit of a bummer was there was no milk. They didn't give us any milk. I'm sure if we asked for milk, they would have given us some, but we're Probably. in a we're on a freaking motorbike. This, this is, is the lodge. It's temporarily closed. Yeah, so this is a big, huge um, ski lodge. Really cool. Where you can come and stay during winter. But no, it was, um, yeah, I mean, it was glamping, wasn't it? It was like camping, but we were just in these wee pods. Oh, you've got to do fat mode. No, it's got to put it in Dynamic Pro and a bit, uh, there we go, Dynamic Pro riding mode and then in fat, fat mode. mode it is. Because I think this road is epically twisty. Oh, no. Yeah, um, it was really, really, really cool and just what an epic spot.
Um, but it was, it was like a bit of a pond there. There were a few mozzies. Not that many, but a few to make it annoying. Yeah, the mozzies weren't that bad, to be, no, to be it, fair. It, I thought they'd be much worse, but... I think we're up quite high. So. It took me about two hours to get to sleep because I had um, like this skin crawl. Oh, where you were, you were sunburned, babe. I think I was sunburnt and it just felt like I had a million ants all over me. And it feels like there's bed bugs in the and bed. And it I feels think. like there's bed bugs in the bed and it's just, I hate, yeah. Yeah, they definitely were bed bugs. Like, it was a really clean bed. No, it was immaculately clean, yeah. yeah. Beautiful, nice, crisp white sheets. And yeah. Yeah. Nice um, new bed and everything, but um, yeah, it was, was not all that difficult to go to sleep because it, it got quite cold at night. Yeah, thankfully it got so cold at night. We yeah. both eventually went to sleep, but then Tom, I woke up about four and he was snoring until about seven. So I just I'm pretty sleep. sure I died last night. <laughs> <laughs> I was listening to you, like to hear if you would breathe at one point, because I couldn't hear you breathing. Oh, look uh, at this big hawk. Woo! Oh, shh. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Wow. Look, look where we are. This is amazing. Isn't it cold? Yeah, but I mean, it was, um, it was really neat. I mean, nice facilities and everything. Like, had a middle bit where they had the kitchen. Yeah, I thought it was great except for the little bedroom that I guess was kind of supposed to be like a little wooden tent. Like a tent. Was, a, was pretty small for a big burly bloke like me. I was just sort of... Yeah. Yeah. He kept standing his head on the... I smacked my head on the fucking door <laughs> about five times. <laughs> By the fifth time I was like, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck no, my life! Like, surely you have learnt after the first time to duck your head. And then this morning, because I'm basically oh. running, <laughs> I basically run off about one brain cell in the morning. <laughs> I was lying in bed and I could feel the down the side of my leg like this icy feeling. I thought, oh, I've got like um, having a stroke. Yeah, I thought like uh, I'm having a stroke or some or something. My muscle is burning so hot that it's giving me this sort of icy sensation. So I just sort of lay there, think, <laughs> thinking to myself. <laughs> no, I was thinking to myself, you know, it'll go soon. It's just it's just a muscle spasm of some sort, you know, that old people get because of the hike yesterday. Anyway, I was like, no, that's not a muscle spasm. Then I was like, oh fuck my life, and I literally emptied the whole water bottle <laughs> over the over the duvet <laughs> and because i was half asleep i just like didn't really understand what was going on and then it all and then i was like oh f it and i like, kid you not tom is an absolute and utter zombie in the morning like he literally doesn't wake up until about 10 10 or 11. i would worry about him driving to work like you'll Frickin' go and drive off a cliff or something. <laughs> or end up in bloody Queenstown or something. Because you're not <laughs> <laughs> There's a few times at work that I've um, sort of got to the job site and Tara and Jordan have looked at me like, why are we here? And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck! Like, <laughs> wrong side. <laughs> uh, yes. Um, anyway, so I, I was saying, I was saying uh, this morning to go and make Tom a cup of tea in bed. I handed him the uh, wolf bottle and he had a drink and obviously didn't put the lid on and um, managed to tip the entire contents all over the duvet. Oh well. That's the sort of thing we're dealing with here. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty bad. But yeah, um, you kind of come right after breakfast. We had a nice big beef this morning. Yeah, as soon as I've eaten, I'm, I'm usually fine. Yeah, normally the problem. He had, uh, oh, we had leftover potato salad, pasta salad, sausages, bacon, uh, fried tomatoes, and some English muffins. Yeah, so we've got 50 minutes of this, which is fine by me, because this is freaking amazing. Um, and then we're straight to the beach. It's gonna be great. Yeah, 
yeah, I'm definitely juice of each time. Probably fall asleep. I, I must make sure to put loads of sunblock on. Yeah, loads of sunblock and we'll have a little rest on the beach. It's going to be great. So the, the next basically week we are by the beach, we're going from one beach spot to the next, aren't we? Uh, yeah, so then we're up to Havelock, uh, which, well, it's not really a beach, it's more of a kind of harbour. Sort of Still by the sea. Well, it is, but it's, yeah, it's not a beach. I always pray the corona is a better eh? That first tip with the lemon. Yeah, to be perfectly honest with you, I crave an ice cold can of Coke in weather like this when it's this well, hot. Oh, I know, absolutely amazing. Yeah. Like that, that day at Christchurch, it was. Yeah, we'll high. never forget that, eh? 30, 36 degrees it was. And we stopped at this tiny dairy, a full, fully, like. Full hotter. leathers, yeah. It was the hottest day I think I've ever, ever experienced in New Zealand, perhaps. And um, we stopped at this tiny wee dairy on the side of the road and got got a cold can of coke and oh my gosh, we just inhaled it, didn't we? Yeah. Absolutely amazing. I think I've discovered my new favourite twisty road. Shame it's so far away from home. What a beautiful spot. Right? Yeah. Woo! I'm cooking, aren't you? Oh my gosh. Probably not as much as you are because I've got really well beaten gear on. Yeah, the leathers are just no so good. You've got no oh, two tiny ones at the top. Wow, look where we are. We're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Well, we had no idea about this road, did we? we we'd never even heard of Mount Lyford, and it was oh, yeah. purely right. accidental. I still, um, I still can't get over the fact that we, we, we drove past that billionaire guy, and he was just there in it. I mean, that's classic New Zealand, isn't it? Yeah, he had the, the big doors up on his McLaren. Well, he's a multi-billionaire. On his own race track. On his own race track, but. What struck me more than anything is he's by himself just cruising around in his McLaren. I mean, no security. The the gates to his racetrack were all wide open. Um, it's hilarious. No fences. Is it just for cars? Yeah, he's a car fanatic, so yeah. he, he's built... Um, got a McLaren, I gather, that he probably is. Well, I think it's a McLaren. Don't quote me on that. I'm not a car. I don't know much about supercars. But if I had to guess, it was a Zonda or a McLaren, but more likely to be a McLaren. No, oh, it looked to me like a um, Ferrari sort of thing. Definitely wasn't a Ferrari. Or a uh, Lamborghini. It's, I don't think it was a Lambo, I think it was a McLaren, and I think it was a McLaren because... It's quite boxy, wasn't it? Well, I think he, he's end. involved with the McLaren, oh, McLaren race, race team. team, yeah. But I might be wrong. 
Oh, you don't see a 15 very often, babe. Is that why you just went, <laughs> Oh, man. This is one of them roads you go to the end, you have a beer, and then you go back and do it again. No, you don't. Oh, my little weapon, uh, uh, this is going to be brilliant. Mm, that's what I'm worried about. Be careful. No, I'll be going the same speed. The difference is I won't weigh 500 kgs. Yeah, so you'll probably be able to go faster. A little bit. Mm. Wow. Oh, what a spot. I know. Amazing. I haven't seen any cars. <laughs> wow, how cool. Who's the other camera? I should have it on my headphone. Yeah, I need to get you a proper camera for your head, to be honest. Well, oh, people are missing out on all this. All they can see is you. Yeah. But, I mean, my camera's going, so it should be fine. Flipping out, you were like a restless rhinoceros last night. <laughs> it was a nightmare. Well, I keep... It was a Slim and mossy, and then a fly got in my hair, and then um, oh, I had to go to the loo, and, and then I, you was, and then you started snoring, and I was just like, oh. Really annoying. Every, you kept waking me up with this boom, 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 and I'm like, what's she doing now? And you were twisting and blooming. Very annoying. I think tonight, the place we're staying at in Kaikoura, we've got a bit more space, which will be nice, because the last two nights we've been sleeping on top of each other, basically. Yeah. We've slept in really small beds the last couple of nights. Yeah. Last, night, last night was a really small bed. And it's very hot. Yeah, I think a beer and some fish and chips tonight. Eh? eh? That's a very, very twisty road. Have you ever known a road to be that twisty? Uh, yes. Ah, uh, yes, the Picton Road. The Picton Road. <laughs> but this one's way faster than that. That's even twistier. That's horrible. Yeah, even I'll admit that that's horrible. <laughs> Oh man, just to get a bit of air through you. Oh, so good. I think I did pretty well back there. I didn't say one thing. You did really well. I was waiting for the me me me. Oh, we're in paradise, babe. It's like the land of milk and honey, isn't it? Amazing. Oh, the sausage. Look at the big like falling down. Yeah. Love those beautiful rolling hills through Glenham. Oh, I know. Gorgeous. Isn't it? Like you're this whole area is amazing. Well, the South Island is amazing. There's just no two ways about it. Every part of it is unreal. Oh, look at this. See this bike, even though we're fully laden, full gear, passenger, all the mods on it, weighs a ton, it, it just loves these twisties. Yeah. Pretty, I mean, it's a very, very strong bike, isn't it? Oh, it's amazing. The torque on it, unreal. 
well the the fact that you can corner so quickly and you know get so low with so much weight on the bike is just amazing I'm presuming we're about to come out at the coast. It's quite light over there. Well, it's lighter and there's no hills. I mean, yeah, it, uh, the hills the end. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah. I mean, today's a really, really short motorbike day, isn't it? But. Um, I think we're due a day of relaxing. We're due a day because tomorrow's a big day on the bike. Yeah, massive. Well, actually, have look. <laughs> Uh, yeah, three. three, three and a half. Probably about three or four. Yeah, by the time we get there, it'll be four hours. Yeah, yeah. You've got a really nice swimming pool here too. Oh yeah. The first ever video we ever did on the Kawasaki was that video. That's right. And you were a felt skinny little thing back then. <laughs> yeah, two, two. Oh, yeah, two. Yeah, so it's Sunday. Saturday oh, night, Sunday night. Train. I hate the way they do that. We're back on the motorway. Or what passes for a motorway in this country. Oh, my gosh, we're here. No. Well, that, this is it. Get out. Oh, you're right. What a great road, I'll remember that one. <laughs> okay, watch out for cops. Slow down, Tom. Five, five kilometres. Yeah. In fact, last time we were here, we met um, Jim and Lou. Jim and Lou, yeah. And we uh, if you're watching Jim and Lou, I hope you're all right and doing well. Yeah. And we hope you had a lovely Christmas. Yeah. Um, I'll have a, a nice cold beer for you. Yeah. Uh, great, so we've it's quarter to 11. We've got all day here. Brilliant. Oh, exploring. we're going to get burnt. We'll be all right. We've got some lot. We've got a lot of mountain biking. Cave tours as well. Welcome to Kaikoura. What a, that's a brilliant road to know that is. Because where does that bring you out? That brings you out miles away in the other... That, that's actually a really good road to know. Now, I haven't actually looked where accommodation is, but I, I'm pretty confident it's one of these right here. And it's got a blue sign on the front. Yeah, it's right up at the beach. Yeah. See, I think it's right here. Grief, tackle that corner. <laughs> right, it, it should be a piece of cake to find. I mean, two options. One, Go right. one Go is left. look at the phone. Or should we just pull in? Pull it in the shade. And just I think that's it right there. there. That's it right there. Do you want to go and have a look? Is it sailed? Yeah, that's it. Blue sign. Yeah, that looks like it. It was definitely sailed, was it? Yeah. Parking. Cool. Unit two. Oh, smell that. Mm. Office. 
There we go. We just asked them if we can leave our bike here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, jump off. Hiya. We You're booked good. we booked in for tonight and we know we're early, but we were just wondering if we could just park the motorbike here and walk into town. Unit four. But we, we don't want to get in. It's you fine. Leave your bike here for sure. Oh, thank, thank you. you. We yeah, just no. want to get out of this. So hot. <laughs> I bet you are. I'm hot like that. I've got the fans on doing the room. Yeah. So no, it'll be ready in half an hour though. If you want. Oh, to. Oh, beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, could we just dump yeah. this on the on the deck? Yeah. Hold. On. I'll, I'll clear the chair for you. Just move the bike to unit four, babe. I will. Yeah. 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 We just chuck it on the floor. Just chuck it in here. Yeah. I'll move there. Then I'll put it inside for you when I've finished. How's that? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. That's a hot day if we went around the mat. Oh. Holy crap, a moly, it's so hot. Wouldn't she stop, eh? Yeah. Perfect. How good is that? Literally across the road to the beach. Oh, no, brilliant, eh? Yeah. Yeah, that's well. Right, leave everything there, nobody's going to nick it. I've forgotten what it's like to live in a country where people steal stuff, eh? Oh, I'm so used people. to leaving my stuff just lying around. Brilliant. Oh, these are stuck to me. Oh. Oh, yuck. Walking down here. We made it. We made it, yay! That was easy. <laughs> I could definitely do that road all day. They oh, I've dropped it. Right, here we go. Kaikoura. Nice little place to stay tucked away. Yeah, perfect. Oh, can you smell the sea? It's so strong. Seaweed. Fishy. Well, yeah, because they have seals. Seaweedy. Seals, remember? Mm. We can jump on the bike later on and just go for a cruise up to the where the seals are and stuff. We might find this. Right. Super smells like they do. All over. Rock and bash on the rock, babe. Wow. It's a pebbly beach down there. This yeah. one is. You can go down the road. There is a sandy beach down there. Yeah. Back down there, but you'd have to gear up. Well, you wouldn't actually. We're going a shorts and t-shirt, to be honest, on the bike. Watch around the corner. You have to go round the head. Back about 10 minutes back down the road, and there's a sandy beach. Right. But to be perfectly right. honest, I prefer pebbles because they're not sharp pebbles, they're um, quite smooth, aren't they? They're round pebbles. <laughs> the first thing we're going to do is get a coffee. Mr. Tom is gagging for a vape and a coffee. For a vape and a coffee. <laughs> I'm and Tubbing and he's away. <laughs> Find us some seals, aren't we, babe? Gonna try. Everybody's over there looking at something, so we'll go and check it out. <laughs> we'll be the sheep like everybody else and see what's going on. And what are they doing, do you think? Whale watching or seal watching? Uh, probably. Look like they're all tourists. <laughs> um, we're quite used to seals, they're stinky things. <laughs> they're quite nice, aren't they? But, 
They stink. They're quite cute. The baby seals are really cute. Oh, the baby seals are gorgeous. Yeah. The big mama and the poppers are stinky ass. Yeah, they're slippery. Oh, they're still pretty cute faces. They're still pretty cute, yeah. But this is the seal spot, isn't it? So we'll have a look. No, he'll give you a nasty bite. All this crap that sun is hot. Yeah, it is, eh? All right, should we go and get something to eat? Yeah, got to see a couple anyway. Yeah. That's the dock guy. Volunteer Department of Conservation. He said. And he said there's more fucking tourists than seals. <laughs> but I'm feeling pretty good. I'm, I'm losing weight. My tummy's disappearing. So yeah. Hey, Tabuena. She's like, I want a beer. Yeah, I've lost my shirt, so right. She lost her shirt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to eat anything, I'm going to drink something. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good spot, eh? Yeah, it's quite cool. More oh, tourists than fucking seals. <laughs> That's hilarious. So we're at, this is Kaikoura, this is where we're staying. I'll just give you a quick goosey gander. We're about to go for a walk. Have we showed them around here yet? Um, I don't think so. Nice little place. Probably the nicest place we've stayed at yet, really, isn't it? Well, on this trip, you mean? On this trip, yeah. I mean, it's nothing flash, but it's just really spacious, isn't it? It's really nice. Yeah, good facilities and nice and spacious. The other two places were very small. Small. Very small. More yeah. like glamping. Yeah. Whereas this is more like motelling. This is definitely my cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> I like space. I'm a big guy. You right? don't keep Bumping yeah. your head on the... Oh, I smacked my head <laughs> so many times on that stupid thing last night. The pod. The pod. The stupid pod. Do you want one stadium to your claustrophobic? No, it's really small inside. It's like a hard thing. Right, we're, gonna, we're going for a walk, sweet Tabuena. That view from the pod was pretty amazing. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm not dissing it, it was very special, but value for money, this is way better. Better? Better. The bike's holding up well. It is starting to get pretty filthy. <laughs> you probably can't see on the camera, but it's absolutely covered in bugs. Millions of them. GoPro doesn't seem to pick up the filthiness of it. It is filthy. Right, we'll walk down the waterfront and then that'll be us for the day. <laughs> right. Did we video down here? I don't think we did, did we? Yeah. It's been a while since we've been to Kokura and actually like stopped. 
Yeah, we That's usually close. just drive through, don't yeah. we? So it's actually we like Krakura. When was the last time we stayed here? Oh, golly. Years ago. Years and years ago. Yeah. Where did we stay? I think it was your, your mum and dad. Mum and dad. Well over ten years Very ago, yeah. Easily. Do you remember that we they um, got this really super flash place? And then we thought it was too expensive, so we, were, we took the kids and went and stayed the um, backpackers, which was vile. Oh, that's right, which is just around the corner, actually. Had, the bunks had bed yeah. bugs, the, the kitchen was thick with grease. Yes, I remember. It was Tom's idea. Where do you want to go? Should we go up this way? No, I'm fine. I'm going to do a quick, brisk walk. Yeah. Oh, I gotta love New Zealand, eh? Hey?